Okay everyone, what I have in my hand is a Tesla meter. It's actually a micro Tesla meter. And what this is used for is to measure electromagnetic fields that electrical appliances put off anything with power. Um, the average electromagnetic field reading, uh, they're generally in milligauss, is a 0.2 to 0.4 milligauss. <coughs> This meter, in order to get convert it to milligauss, you just move the decimal place over one point. So it's actually measuring 1.7 milligauss right now. So we're within the average, uh, you know, not far from the average of a home. Um, there are a lot of concerns about what EMF can do to your health. They believe it could cause cancer, it could cause leukemia, uh, all, all sorts of problems, um, fatigue, um, headaches, nausea. Um, the government has set some standards where they're saying they call it the prudent avoidance uh, number. Based on the studies, they don't know all the health effects, so they're saying that you should avoid um, EMF of 4.0 or higher. Uh, they do believe that some children who grew up in homes that had an average of 4.0 milligauss uh, developed childhood leukemia, so there's that concern. Um, but just keep in mind, the average for your home is 0.2 to 0.4. But um, right here, I have a little Walmart fan that I bought three years ago. Um, cost me about five dollars, and I had this by my bed for three years. I'm going to turn this on, and I want to show you how much electromagnetic field this puts out. Okay, just a maybe six inches in front of it. I'm getting about, remember we have to move the decimal point, so I'm getting about 225 milligauss. If I get close to the source, it maxes out my meter. My meter will measure, let me see if I can show you, this meter will measure 20,000 milligauss and it just maxed out my meter. So again, if I put it near the source, it maxes out. If I put it on the highest sensitivity, it's actually measuring about 7,000 milligauss. This is higher than any appliance, electrical output, or anything in my home. All of them combined. This puts out more energy than my entire house, everything in it combined. I slept with this next to my head for three years. This is a Walmart fan. Uh, I would avoid it at all costs. It's a death trap.